Good morning, guys. Uh, doing a little vlog we haven't done it in a while. Today's kind of a special day. It is Friday, uh, the 25th. Oh, hold on. That's what is that? No, we're gonna turn that off. Um, yeah, it's the 25th. It's Friday. It's 3 a.m. Actually, like 3:15 a.m., 3:18 a.m. And uh, we are gonna go to see Batman v Superman, which you guys probably gonna see our review of very probably before even this vlog goes up. Um, so we're gonna do that at 9:45 at the IMAX screening. We're not doing a 3D because that's stupid. Um, um, but um, so what I'm doing right now, the reason I'm awake at 3 a.m. is I want to make sure. Uh, I, uh, one, was awake for the movie, and two, um, get a workout in for technically Thursday, um, so I took a little nap last night, or, I mean, I guess last night, but I took a little nap at about, uh, 7 p.m., and I woke up at about, uh, I mean, a little nap, but I woke up at, like, 11 p.m., so I've been up all night. So I'm going to go work out, get that in, uh, go back home and shower. So let's go ahead and uh, go work out. And then uh, we might be watching Man of Steel before we go watch Batman v Superman. So let's let's go ahead and do this. And just in case you guys didn't believe me, uh, there's the clock on my dash. It says 3, 3.20. And as you can see, it's dark out. So, it's not 320. And just in case you guys didn't believe me. Just arrived at the gym. I took a pre-workout. Hopefully it'll keep and give me enough energy to do this. Lately, this pre-workout. Well, I haven't taken a while. And it used to really give me a lot of energy but now that I'm back on it because it's been a while since I used it so now that I'm back on it it doesn't seem to affect me as well and I don't want to increase the dosage because that's probably bad especially taking more than what's required um, but that being said the reason I figured I'd let you guys know uh, I actually like nighttime and the reason for that is I don't know how much of the driving I'm gonna put in the vlog but one uh, I don't have to deal with idiots on the road because there's a lot of them and two you will see when we get in here but the gym is empty this is a 24 7 gym and it is a pretty big gym and during the day it's slammed and my old gym uh, at nighttime was a really popular gym also um, which was also 24 7 gym uh, but that one used to be a lot busier than this one is so I'm really happy to come in here at nighttime and uh, not have to worry about what workouts I'm gonna do and if anybody's gonna be doing them as I want to go do them so I'm gonna go in I'm gonna do some cardio then some weightlifting and then we'll continue from there This is why I like coming at night. Basically, empty. Oh, it's great. It's almost like it's my own personal gym.
So I don't like doing uh, deadlifts. And I know it's the best workout you can possibly do. One of the best, but I have a bad back, so I do these pack extensions. All right, workout complete. Getting into the car. Gonna go home, drink my supplements, and then uh, obviously take a shower uh, and see if I can get Delver to show up to my house so we can watch Man Steel before we go see Batman vs Superman. So yeah. All right guys, so I figure real quick, before anybody asks, I show you what supplements I take. All right, this right here is my aminos. Uh, they have a little bit of caffeine in it to give you energy throughout the day. I take them about midday. Um, honestly, nothing special. It's uh, off amino from, well, who is the company? Uh, why am I missing this? There we go, sell your car. This is my pre-workout, AC G3 charged. This is the one I was talking about. Uh, it do it hasn't done, so the serving suggests is one to two scoops. I would say I've been thinking about one to one and a half scoops. I haven't really been noticing the pre-workout um, charge that I normally get from it. But uh, it's still a good pre-workout. And then here's the protein. Yes, it's GNC. I get the 100% uh, whey protein, 24 grams of protein. Honestly, it's the same from what I understand. Um, in the same warehouse, they make the Optimum Nutrition protein. So it is the same protein as Optimum Nutrition. And I like Optimum Nutrition. This was the better deal. So I got it. So that's it. All right, just got done getting ready. I need a haircut pretty bad. It's, it's getting kind of ridiculous. But uh, right now, just gonna work on some uh, video editing. Gonna do a gaming video real quick. I already actually recorded it, but there's some things I wanna adjust on it. So I'm gonna do that behind me real quick. And then um, uh, I'm gonna hopefully get a hold of Dalbor. We'll see if he wakes up. We might not be watching Man of Steel before we go see the movie. It's supposed to be at 9.45. It is currently... Oh, can you see that? It's currently 5.41. So, it's a two-hour movie, I believe, for Man of Steel. A little more than that. Uh, yeah, he would have to get here now. <laughs> so, uh, we'll see if I can get a hold of him. I'll work on the video, and we'll go from there. All right, the uh, game video is rendering... Couldn't get Dalbor to get up to watch Man of Steel before we go see Batman v Superman. I will be going to meet him though for breakfast at a different place that we've never tried before, or at least I haven't. So we're gonna go there and you know, get some breakfast before the movie. Even though I've been up for a while, so technically this is my lunch. Um, and then we're gonna go see the movie. just had breakfast at this place and I would give it out of 10 an 8. What do you say? Uh, I would, the, the omelet, I would definitely give 8. But you've had their omelet. skillets and you don't the like The skillets them. were not as good compared to other places. But that was like months ago, so I don't know, maybe they changed their recipes. I had a chipotle wrap, which they were kind enough to say I can get in the AM. And it was delicious. And their seasoned fries were good, so I give it an eight. All right, movie time. What's going on guys? So I'm driving back. I know I shouldn't be vlogging and, and driving, but I just wanted to finish, uh, basically gonna end this vlog here. Uh, we just got done with the movie. You guys are gonna see the no, non-spoilers review already. Uh, we are gonna be, as we said in that video, we are gonna be doing the spoilers review on Sunday or Monday. Um, 
but I mean, if you if you watch this, but you haven't watched our review of uh, Batman v Superman, uh, go see it. Uh, essentially, is uh, what the final verdict was on that. Go see the movie; it's absolutely amazing. Uh, I I can't I can't believe that there's any bad reviews on this movie. Um, the the whole point of those reviews is literally to just give negativity where it's not deserved. Listen, is the movie perfect? No, but it's damn near perfect. There, it has its issues, but you know what? Like, it's not issues that these reviewers would actually know about. It's, it's, it, they're reviewing the movie essentially as a movie, and they're saying that there's something wrong with it. They're wrong. As a movie, this is a phenomenal movie. As a comic book movie and comic book nerds, you guys might have something that you might not like about the movie, but trust me, this movie is perfect. It, uh, it it's damn near perfect, and there's no reason why not to go pay for the for the movie and have these guys basically tell these guys to make more movies because they need to keep making these movies. So go show some support and go watch the movie. It's great. You won't be disappointed. Unless you are, then I don't know what you want from a movie and neither do the people who make them. So uh, otherwise, go see it. Uh, that's it, guys. We're going to end the vlog here. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one.